Yeah, very, very unusual uh, body, like we said. And, and here are the stats to prove it. This is the livingfitnutrition.com. Tail of the tape. Matt Dwyer is uh, eight years the younger. He's three inches taller. You see the weights there. Dwyer had to cut up to 180. Uh, it was uh, just about 185 for Demarcus Johnson. So it's going to be a middleweight contest, and Dwyer is going to have a four-inch reach advantage. All right, let's get the fighters introduced for the main event. Inside the cage we go. Here he is, Ryan Ventura. Ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for our main event of the evening, brought to you by GoDaddy.com. Visit GoDaddy.com, the world's largest domain registrar. Our next bout is in the BFL middleweight division. Now, for the moment we've all been waiting for, Live from the River Rock Show Theater in Richmond, BC, it's time. It's fight time! Three five minute rounds of BFL Fight League action. Introducing first the fighter in the blue corner. This man stands at six feet, one inch tall. He weighed in at 184.5 pounds. With a record of 19 wins, 13 losses. Representing elite performance in Salt Lake City, Utah, USA. Demarcus Johnson! <laughs> and his opponent in the red corner. This man stands at six feet, four inches tall. He weighed in at 180 pounds. With a record of six wins, one loss. Representing Toshino MMA in Kelowna, BC. He is the undisputed BFL welterweight champion of the world, yeah. Matt Dwight! Hey, fighters to the center, please. Okay, guys, I want to fight hard, fight within the ropes. If I say stop, stop. If I say fight, you fight, okay? I want you guys to touch gloves if you so wish. Go back to the corners, guys. Wait for the call. All right, Tony Williamson, our referee, will just uh, remind everybody, even though Matt Dwyer was introduced as our welterweight champ, this, is, this actual fight is uh, actually at middleweight, so it is a non-championship contest, so it will actually only be three five-minute rounds. That's right. All right, here we go. Demarcus Johnson, he is in the white with red and gray. It is Matt Dwyer in the black with white trim. Let's see if Demarcus can get on the inside of Matt Dwyer. Yeah, he's got a good long head. reach. He's working good head movement. Good combination by Dwyer. Oh, big shot lands from DeMarcus Johnson, and Dwyer could be in a little bit of trouble right now. Yeah, I think he's still rocked. Dwyer lost his mouthpiece, and yeah, he now he goes to the clinch. Uh, Johnson really rocked him there. Yeah, he rocked him twice, went for the liver as well, so he's got a, he's got, the ref should be stopping this to make sure that he, uh, he gets that mouth guard back in. Yeah, Dwyer knows he's in a fight. He looks like he still might be recovering here. As uh, Dwyer nods down to his mouthpiece here, Tony Williamson doesn't really notice it. It's a good boxing shown from Demarcus Johnson early in this one. And as they get into kind of a, a neutral uh, clinch here up against the cage, Tony Williamson does uh, get the mouthpiece into David Lee, and this is a little bit of an advantage for Matt Dwyer, who needs a, probably a few seconds here to recover from a couple of big shots. He actually doesn't look too bad after being rocked. He got rocked twice, one really good one, and again, um, he needs to watch out for that left hook. He needs to keep his right hand up when he's striking. He keeps his hands low when he throws that jab. Demarcus Johnson now coming on, lands a couple of shots. Both guys trading jabs here. Yeah. Dwyer lands with the right there, it looked like. Dw Dwyer needs to keep that right hand up. He's going to catch a couple hooks. He's got to keep both hands up. Looks like DeMarcus got very heavy hands, both right hook and left hook. Oh, big shot lands. Right lands, just misses with the left. Oh, and a big shot. Big shot to the uh, kidney there for Johnson. Dwyer needs to let this, uh, this fight take place. He's got to relax. Um, DeMarcus is, you know, he had a good uh, camp, uh, uh, but he did have a tough weight loss, so. Oh, big shot from Johnson, if, and that knocks uh, Dwyer to the ground here. And now it's Johnson looking for the uh, standing guillotine. Yeah, it looked like he got caught as he, uh, he, he gave a kick to the head to Johnson. So Johnson took a kick to the head, Dwyer took, got a, a straight right to, the, to off balance him. So, uh, you know, 
it, he might not be as rocked as you think he is, but uh, it definitely when you get punched in the face, it's going to rock you a little bit. Uh, Dwyer's going for the takedown. He needs to get a little bit lower to, to on the legs. Um, DeMarcus gets the underhook and sw switches. They clinch up against the cage halfway through round number one. Dwyer looking for a couple of those sharp elbows. Yeah, Johnson. he cut him. He oh, cut him he did cut him of that big elbow there. He should, he's cut, but he's not hurt. He's not hurt, but that's going to take some, uh, in the later rounds, it's going to wear him out a little bit. When you bleed, you lose oxygen, and it'll tire you out. But he's going to be slippery, so, he, you know. Oh, good oh, elbow. big elbow from uh, Dwyer now. Looks like, uh, oh, good liver shot by uh, Demarcus Johnson. And all that blood on, dry, blood on dryer that you see right now, that's all from that uh, uh, cut to the right side of the head of uh, Demarcus Johnson. Matt Dwyer having trouble getting out of the way of some of those big, heavy shots yeah. here. Dwyer needs to get his hands up. He doesn't want to overcommit on that jab. Um, I can't believe how heavy the hands are of Johnson. He's got real heavy hands, and uh, Dwyer is showing his ability to take a punch. Uh, wow, ac action-packed round number one here. He's got to keep his hands up, and he's got to start angling a bit. He's going too straight forward and back. He's getting caught. He's got to work his angles a bit to help him not uh, so DeMarcus doesn't get set and his feet planted. Uh, he's got to move around a little bit, work his jab, and work his kicks. If he can get a takedown here, it might help him out a bit. Oh, Good a couple of shots boxing. landed from Matt Dwyer. I, that uppercut just missed, but I think he did catch him on that third shot, which was a right. Yeah, it'd be good to see some, uh, oh, he, he's got to watch, he doesn't want to walk too far around to DeMarcus's hips, because Marcus can get a throw in. He wants to stay square to his opponent. All right, final 40 seconds here in an eventful round number one. Guys, they're swinging for the fences now, these two. Oh, good counter right hand by Dwyer. Dwyer should do a little bit more angling just to make sure that he doesn't get those uh, get those heavy hands and, and oh, good knee. Oh, he might be hurt now. Johnson might be hurt here in the final 10 seconds. Dwyer looking to do big time damage here. Now Johnson comes back and swings away, just missing with a left. Wow, what a round number one that was. What a finish, what a finish to that round. Um, great knees, great elbows, very confident, very good chin on Matt Dwyer. Um, it looks like uh, Demarcus Jones is a little bit rocked. He's, uh, he looks a bit tired, um, but does he ever have heavy hands? He's, he's sitting down on those punches and getting some good left and right hooks in. <laughs> No, no Vaseline, no Vaseline. I gotta, gotta be put the Vaseline man. on this cut. Gotta be the cut man. Where's the cut man? Cut hey, man. he told me I could put it on. Hey, cut man! Can I, can I get this Vaseline on this cut? Hey, there you go. even through a, a teep kick, which is a front left kick to the liver of DeMarcus right at the end there. So um, let's see what happens in round two. All right, here we go, round number two. The corner of Matt Dwyer calling for straight punches. Yeah. We'll see if, see if he does that. Straight punches, some angling would be great. You know, keeping his hands up would be a, a, another positive. All right, round number two, here we go. First round is exciting. We'll see if the second round is equally exciting. Yeah. Front push kick from Dwyer. Yeah, those push kicks are going to keep the distance and, and keep him honest. He, you know, he wants some inside kicks, some front push kicks, some uh, jabs, and keeping his elbows in when he throws his right hand. He doesn't want to come over the top too much. Good oh, nice. Hook. Yeah, nice left. You're right about the power of DeMarcus Johnson, though. But you wonder a little bit if he's gassing just a touch here. Yeah, he, he, he definitely doesn't have the, the punch, the, the spark in his punch as he did in the first round. But, uh, you know, he is heavier. He's a lot, you know, he, he is putting everything into those punches. He's bleeding quite good now. I think he's also bleeding from the nose or the mouth. 
Great head movement, though, from Johnson. Hey, just getting out of the way of some of those big power punches from Matt Dwyer. Yeah, he's got great hands. Dwyer needs to work on those push kicks a little bit more and straighten out his punches, follow up with the left hook. But yeah, good right hand there. There's the jab. He needs to jab and angle a little bit. Uh, you know, doesn't want to sit. You know, he knows he's, 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 he's taking a punch. He's taking the hardest that DeMarcus can give. So as long as he doesn't get caught, he's in good shape. Now we're going to see what kind of shape. Yeah, and that's exactly what I was looking for. What kind of gas tank DeMarcus Johnson had at this point in the fight. Could Dwyer take him down? And that was an easy takedown. Yeah, it was. He, he, didn't, he didn't have any, anything in the gas to fight off that takedown. Um, Oh, I think he opened up another cut there too with that uh, with that right hand there. It looked like uh, bounced him off, and now Demarcus Johnson is taking some big time shots here from Dwyer. Yeah, he's, he's just Dwyer's got to be a little patient. And our referee Tony Williamson calls for time. I think he's going to look at the cut maybe on the back. Oh no, it's a mouth guard. Okay, and he restarts them here. So now Matt, uh, Matt's got to be a little bit more patient. He's got to be patient. Doesn't want to get caught in any any submissions. They are slippery. A lot of blood. Blood is slippery. That's the second time that mouth guard's come out. If it comes out again, he'll get disqualified uh, by professional rules. Uh, he can't be spitting out his mouth guard Matt like that. Matt Dwyer now going to town. Tony Williamson looking on. Johnson trying to defend here. Round number two. We still got just under three minutes. Dwyer, a little bit of a mistake there. Almost fell over top of him now. Yeah, he's got to watch his balance, but he's doing really good uh, ground and pound. He's staying on his feet. And That's once again, we're getting the stoppage from our referee, uh, Tony Williamson. I think it's going to be, once again, it's that uh, mouth guard of DeMarquez Johnson. Yeah, and this is, you know, it's unfortunate for Matt because, I mean, he gets a rest too, but DeMarcus is definitely getting a rest by this. He actually might get his cut checked out uh, by the doctor because he's bleeding quite heavily above the eye there. Yeah, and it's very interesting to see as we see a shot, a good shot there of Johnson, who this favors more. It did seem like as we came out for round number two, it was Dwyer that had a little bit more in the tank. Yeah, and, and it's gonna it's gonna favor both of them really to be honest. Dwyer needs a rest, but uh, he could have finished that. Uh, he had a good chance to finish that fight uh, there, but Johnson didn't get enough rest to to come back. Uh, he, he, what he needs is a good minute, and he needs the bell. He needs to survive the bell. But this guy's got heart. He's got a lot of heart, and he has got the uh, he's got the technique to, to. And he's been here before. He can last through it if he if he uh, plays his game right. But he doesn't want to lose that mouth guard again. Dwyer on top here, looking for some big shots. Landing a couple of them now. Those, those shots are starting to land a little bit here. Johnson trying to cover up. Oh, and now he's just working on the body here. Oh, big cut, obviously. I can't see where it's coming from. There's a lot of blood now coming from the head of DeMarquez Johnson. Matt Dwyer trying to finish this fight. He's got two minutes to do it. He doesn't want to punch himself out, though. He's slipping everywhere from the blood. He's got to be very careful. Um, you know, it's going to be hard to get a submission, but he's just got to watch that blood. It's like it's like Vaseline. It's not like water. That blood is very slippery. You got to watch your technique. Now he's got to no. choke on him. He's got to choke on him. It's a, it's a, you know, he's just putting pressure on him, keeping the breath away from him. You can see Demarcus's face. He can't breathe when he's been smothered like that. Matt trying to get into full mount here. This, yeah, it, Matt Dwyer being able to, and that's it, this fight is over. Our referee, Tony Williamson, calls to an end with about a minute left in round number two. Both guys totally, totally spent. Matt Dwyer, second round victory, TKO, wow, what a fight. Well, it, it, you know, he, he weathered the early storm. Uh, you know, DeMarcus had these heavy hands. He almost, uh, you know, he almost got the KO. He rocked uh, Dwyer. Dwyer was on the ground. He he got back up and he he shown his resiliency. He uh, he's covered in the, the his opponent's uh, his own opponent's blood. But you know that it all started with that elbow. It came down to that elbow inside fighting, a little dirty boxing, some good knees, uh, good plumb knees, and then he worked his outside game like he in the second round like he should have. All right, let's make it all official for the main event. Inside the cage we go. Here he is, Ryan Ventura. Ladies and gentlemen, the referee has called for a stoppage of the fight at 3 minutes, 39 seconds in round number two. For your winner, the fighter in the red corner, Matt Dwyer!